Werner Tobin here at the Commodity Classic in Denver, Colorado. I am over at PTX Trimble now, catching up with Bryce Baker. Bryce, great to see you again. Good to see you again, Bernard. Hey, I want to talk about some technology. Um, we're going to talk autonomy here now. And uh, PTX Trimble's been working on an autonomy platform. The first thing we're seeing is the Outrun Autonomous Grain Cart. Tell us about it. Yeah, so this unit here is the Outrun Kit that can go on, um, right now it's in development for various tractors or available for um, John Deere working on fence. Uh, but it's essentially a platform, an autonomous platform that can be retrofit onto a farmer's existing tractors um, and allows for autonomous operation. So it, as being a platform, there will be multiple iterations of use cases for that. The first one that's being worked on and is available in the United States for uh, the 2025 season is an autonomous grain cart. Now, Bryce, it's also available in Canada, correct? Yes, that's right. Available in Canada as well. I should have said North America. Let's talk about the benefits here. Obviously, this is a big part of this is labor savings. Mm. Tell us about you know what farmers are going to save with this kit. Yeah. So really, I'd say there's two situations. So let's say there's someone who just doesn't have enough labor on their farm. They're struggling to find labor, and it really delays their harvest. And essentially, that means that their crop is more prone to um, lodging from wind damage, some of the losses in yield that can come from in corn, you know, maybe butt shelling um, or some of the, the breakage while you harvest that drier crop. Some of those issues that actually cost you yield. Having an autonomous system can actually add a person, so to speak, so you can speed up that harvest and get that done. The second place I would say is for a farmer who's looking just to increase efficiency. They don't necessarily have a labor problem where they don't have enough people to be in all their vehicles, but maybe, man, they wish they could get harvest done a little bit sooner so they can let a guy go to get their tillage started, get residue broken down earlier, or maybe even beat winter uh, to get that tillage done. And so actually just having another person, if you will, in the autonomous space to deploy someone else to improve the efficiency of the whole operation is kind of the second use case for a farmer there, which has some agronomic benefit as well to getting thing tillage done earlier, carbon breakdown, and so on. He talked about the operator experience um, in the combine and the technology link up how, and, and how it works. Yeah, so essentially this is the unit that would go on the roof of the tractor cab. It's got internet connection, GPS receivers, obviously all, all that. And then in the, there's a unit that goes on the combine. Then the operator in the combine would have control from an iPad. So you could call the call the autonomous tractor, the grain cart, to the combine. It would line up and link up and sync up with the combine. And then at that point, the operator in the combine has full control over that tractor and that grain cart. So from the iPad app and the combine, they can nudge the tractor forward or back as they're unloading on the go to make sure they get that grain cart filled. Once they're filled, they shut off the auger. They can just hit stop if they need to put another dump on to fill, or they can send it to a staging area, which would be back at the end of the field, maybe where the trucks are going to come. And then the truck driver would get in, load the truck, send it back to the combine. So the interface is on the iPad in the combine, and the operator in the combine has control, so they're in the same field, of, over where that grain cart goes. Hey, let's talk a little bit more about uh, autonomy at PTX Trimble. Uh, you mentioned platform. There's more coming, right? You're working on some tillage. Yeah, so what's available for sale in 2025 is the autonomous grain carts, which is compatible with John Deere 8R and 8000R series tractors, 2014 and newer with an IVT transmission. Fent is in the works. It's being tested. But there's also in 2025, there's also some testing for tillage. Um, that's going on. So autonomous tillage would be kind of the next thing. Tillage is not for sale yet, but it would be the same kit with maybe some additions for tillage. As you think about tillage, a very different application, um, but generally the same base hardware. Well, great stuff, Bryce. We'll look for that. Uh, maybe next time we're at Commodity Classic. Uh, always great to catch up with you. Thanks for making some time for Real Agriculture. Yeah, of course. You've got it, Bernard. Thanks.